Mr. Wilkinson. Oh, hey. Hey. Hi. Mayor Lucian, nice to meet you. Yeah. So I hear you're into interview for the um, the new news anchor position on yeah. the o'clock yeah. news. Yeah. Okay, so um, you have an experience. I see on your resume you said you worked at a pizza shop, a gas yeah. station, yeah. and Walmart. Pizza, cash, and, cash and chow. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, um, when people walked in, you know, I'd, I'd tell them the weather. Okay, so you do realize the 9 o'clock news has no weather forecast involved with it? Wait, is this 9 o'clock news? 9 o'clock yeah. p.m. news. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I completely understand. There's no weather involved? No, no. You'll be telling people news stories? Yes, yes. No weather, <laughs> not a meteorologist, no. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to do a test scenario, and what you're going to be reporting on this time is a shooting that happened in Harrisburg. Two people were killed. Two people, what? Yeah, a man and a woman, age. and there were three young w women injured, okay? All right, that's okay. cool. So we're going to do a test shot of that, okay? So you just going to be on air? Or? No, no, we're interviewing you. Okay, so um, you're going to be observed by a panel of judges, and you'll be on in three. Oh, you need to put the phone down, sir. Yeah, I'm sorry. Uh, offset, please. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. <coughs> you good? Yeah, I'm good, sir. Uh, Thank you. Alright, uh, welcome back to Channel 9 News. We just got in that uh, two people in Harrisburg were gunned down violently by one terrible violent person. The authorities are looking for this person, uh, unknown whereabouts. But if you have any suspicions around the Harrisburg area, please call the police immediately. People that were died, the names are not coming through, but it was a man and a woman walking through the streets of Harrisburg. And I think Kevin over here, he has more to tell us about it. Kevin? Perfect. Okay, thank you. Um, who will let you know? Thank you, thank you for your time, sir. You may, you may go now. Good afternoon. This is Daryl Lucian with the WDRK9 News Team. Today we have a variety of breaking news stories, including further developments in yesterday's shooting. We're also going to be talking about a few tips on how to prevent getting sunburn over the summer, plus a look on some of the softer side stories of the Olympics. All this and more today. Oh, hey. Sorry, the traffic uh, held me up a little bit. Oh, no. <clears throat> yes. we, we now turn to our resident news anchor, Aiden news Wilkinson, anchor. who has. Oh. Ah. Shut up, Lane. I'm hired? Yes. Alright, let's go. What is this thing again? <clears throat> so, <laughs> yesterday there was a shooting. Uh, two people were shot. The uh, policemen are still looking for the shooter. Harrisburg. Uh, <coughs> and traffic today. I don't know if I'm supposed to do traffic, but you know, it, it backed me up pretty bad getting here. So uh, I was stuck in uh, under that one bridge by the river. Um, I was there for about two hours. <coughs> yes, we, we now go on the scene to Kevin Bates, who will be reporting live. Oh, hey. What was that? You were late. I had to go on, and I'm the cameraman. I had to record myself. I did that at all these jobs. You're not even dressed. Not You're not even dressed. So when am I supposed Walmart. to be dressed? You're on TV. I'm dressed perfectly fine. You're not dressed wearing... Do you not get the letter we sent home with you? No, I don't not have dress a mailbox. Code. I don't have a mailbox. What am I supposed to do if I don't, I don't have a mailbox? Listen, okay. You know what? I, I did first fine. Day, your first I walked day. in big... I, had, I was in a situation that you put me in, and I, I sliced right through. Okay, okay, okay. I that's sliced it, right great. through. This was your first day. Okay, yeah. that's fine. That's fine. I'm under a tomorrow, lot of stress. Tomorrow, I expect you to come in wearing your full uniform, nice what, what blazer uniform? and tie, okay. a blazer tie with right. a white dress shirt, slacks preferably. Would have been good to know that. And this thing, you ask what it is. What is it? I don't it's a teleprompter control panel. And you push these buttons and it changes the little words that show up and tell you what to say. It also controls the weather forecast, which you will not be giving, or traffic. 
You do not cover traffic. Okay. Okay? okay. And also, for further notice, this is mine. Yes, Mom. I don't like the attitude. <laughs> All right, I'll We're do my job. Have, I will do my job. I have Jim coming in to cover the rest of the broadcast, but tomorrow you are on your own, and I expect better. Do you understand? I understand. Okay, well, then go. Come on, leave. Um, You're done. Okay. Hey, good morning, uh, Zach. Good morning. Oh, good morning. whoa, 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 whoa. What are you wearing? Fancy, ready to tell the news. Okay, in the okay. News. I said a white dress shirt, a blazer, and slacks. This is a green puffy winter vest, a white t-shirt, and shorts. You look like a surfer who's got lost in Vermont. And likes green. You told me to dress up. I and dress up. I do you dre realize... I dressed up. With the white t shirt hey, and blade. Hey, hey. Look at that. Do you see that? What color is that green screen? It's green, obviously. This is also green. So, whatever is on the green screen will also be on your body. Uh, so, if there's weather, which there won't be, I need to remind you apparently, yeah. it will also be on here. Yeah. Which will be very confusing. So. But they'll say, oh, look like he's wearing a green vest, which looks really cool. They can't see and because they. It'll, it won't be green, it'll be whatever is on the screen. Look, it say, Do you look, own a blazer? It's like one of those black coats. That they I've wear. never worn one in my life. Okay, we're well, going to have to get one, but for today, I'm not going to call in a replacement. This is not my responsibility, Aiden. Well, you're acting like I my man. You're am, acting like my man. I'm you know? the cameraman, and because and of budget... You know what? I can do really well, all right? You're giving me a lot of stress as a news reporter, and you're not giving me all the information, all right? You didn't even give me the script yesterday. You know why? Because that's not my job. I am just the cameraman who was assigned to pick a new anchor and well, make sure Well, where's the person that is supposed to tell me all this stuff? That was Because you're, you're the one that was hiring me. You that know was what? Who picked a cameraman to hire a new... That person? was included in the packet that came to your mailbox, which apparently doesn't exist. Ah. Okay, so, so you're going to sit down here, you're going to sit down, and you're going to do the report, and you'll look like a dork because you're green. But that's fine, and tomorrow you will come, and you will not make mistakes like this. Again. Understood? Yeah. Okay, sit down. Whoever you are. Sit. I don't even know who you are. Manager? I don't know. I'm the cameraman who has to deal with the bumbling yeah, he's the person buffoon of the an person anchor. That bumbles around. Okay, just be quiet. We're on in three minutes. All right. I need you to be ready and don't act like a dork. Hello, my name is Aiden Wilkinson. And uh, welcome to W-R- D-O-R-K. C-D-U-C-R-K. Nine. <laughs> yes, and uh, we are going to be looking at the news today. The uh, news today in uh, downtown Harrisburg, they are now constructing a barge, a large barge, a commercial vessel. <laughs> actually, uh, my grandpa used to drive barges, but uh, they're actually taking the, um, the big wreckage around the city. They're putting it up into crates, you know, like the wreckage of the shooting yesterday, I think. Yeah? That's right. Well, uh, anyway, they are cleaning up the city <clears throat> and putting them in bio containers on the vessel. And the vessel will go out to sea and dump all the wreckage and uh, trash in the sea. All right. <laughs> Smart little idea. Uh, uh, yeah. So, uh, anyway, uh, traffic. Uh, <laughs> 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 the traffic today uh, was actually pretty good. Uh, not Talk as good, though, as today. Talk, Talk about the stabbing. Uh, oh, yes, the stabbing <laughs> in Harrisburg. It was kind of like today when I walked into work. You know, that feeling of just not knowing how cruel the manager will be. Or, <clears throat> sorry, the cameraman. <laughs> how cruel he will be when you walk in. Oh, my gosh, it was terrible. It was. I was insulted. He screamed at me. And, uh, <clears throat> oh, yes, um, stabbing, <clears throat> back to the news, uh, he was found and shot in the back. He was found and shot in, I think it was Central Park. I don't know. I don't know. I was, oh. All right, now to Kevin. I need to take this phone call.
my cap inside. Oh, oh my word, we're on there. Go, 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 go. <coughs> Hello, my name is Kevin Lance, and uh, I am in northern Harrisburg, right near the uh, line of the war zone. Uh, not, not in the fire, but we have had a few shots taken at us, uh, and I thought, I thought that Aiden was supposed to be coming. No, he left. All right, so yeah, we've been patrolling the riverside. Uh, we actually lost Harry a few miles ago, and, um, and uh, you can see there's a bunch of wreckage and weights, weight lifting on the floor uh, from bombs. They drop weights on us. Uh, yes. Um, We've been trying to clean up, but the war is just, it's just terrible. It's terrible indeed. Uh, we've been studying bottle bombs like this. You see this anywhere, please call the authorities. They're yeah, bottle bombs, they're very bad. Uh, now, come here, uh, down here. You sure how we can be on? Uh, Alright, uh, down here, it's... This was Planet Fitness before the war. Uh, bombs went off here, pushing everything to the side. The oxygen level out is actually uh, lowering. Uh, well, Kevin, in concern for your safety, we now return to the studio, where we'll be returning to broadcaster Aiden Wilkinson. It's been a pleasure having him, but unfortunately, yes, it has. Aiden Wilkinson will be leaving the News 19 here at WDORK Networks. No. We now transition to a scene from the classic hit I'm not leaving. Brady Bunch. What are you? What are you? What are you doing? Oh no! Off air! Off air! Off air! What are you doing? Off. I've been hired here. Off! I'm firing you now. <sighs> Off! Standing right here because you hired me. You're not even my manager. How can you even fire me? You know what I'm gonna do? There, see, a really embarrassing picture of you. Look at that. It's great. You can't see it. I know, but they can. I'm tired of you incompetent, bumbling buffoons, and for that reason, you are fired. So you're not even my manager, so you cannot. Ah. 